Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to the Toilet Studios. I am your friendly neighborhood Starman. Welcome back to Final Fantasy VII Classic here on Throwback Thursdays. And here we are at Sector 7. And we and this is where we this is our checkpoint. And we our heroes blew up Mako Reactor Mako Reactor. Hmm. Yeah, I think it was one, I think, but I can't remember. It's been a while. It's been a while since I started recording. So anyways, now we must head to rendezvous with the others at 7th Heaven, Tifa's Bar. And of course, everybody else goes in. <clears throat> the patrons just get kicked out because they have some official avalanche business to discuss inside Tifa's Bar. <laughs> Barrett. Alright, so let's go meet up with everybody else. Did you hear? No, what? There's a news update. They say that there was a terrorist explosion up above, and this time it was a Mako reactor. Y you know what this means? No, what? You see, I keep on top of these things, and if you ask me, if you knock out Mignus Migar's power, then all of its computers and signals are going to be knocked out too. Financially, there must have been about a billion gil worth of damage. And that ain't all. A lot of innocent people got killed too. If the explosion had been in the middle of the night, that would have been one thing. At least the people could have gone in their sleep. Wow. Alright, and there is Barrett waiting for us. <laughs> Here we have a couple. Woohoo! Jeez, I'm blitzed! I just love them homemade cocktails, but they sure do creep up on you! Alright, and there is Barrett. Okay, go on ahead. Alright, let's go inside Tifa's bar. Seventh Heaven. Papa! Uh, and then little Marlene. Marlene, aren't you going to say anything to Cloud? Welcome home, Cloud. Looks like everything went well. Did you fight with Barrett? Not this time. Hmm, you've grown up. When you were little, you used to get into fights at the drop of a hat. This is Tifa. We're gonna go ahead and select that. Flowers. How nice. You almost never see them here in the slums. But a flower for me? Oh, Cloud, you shouldn't have. Now, this is where you decide where... You the affinity system takes place in Final Fantasy VII Classic. Now, if you choose to give it to Marlene, you will earn an affinity point with Barrett. But I want to build affinity points for Tifa, because it's all going to lead to a special event down the, later in the game. So we're going to give this flower to Tifa, like we see in the Final Fantasy VII Remake. Thank you, Cloud. It smells wonderful. Maybe I should fill the store with flowers. <clears throat> Sorry, Cloud. Marlene seems a bit a little shy. And there's Biggs. Ah, nothing like that first drink after a job. <gasps> why don't you have one too? Yeah, why not? Oh, that's more like it. Even if you were a soldier, you're still a rookie here, so you better listen to whatever I tell you. Wedge. Oh, Cloud! Tifa really knows how to cook! Anyway, let me tell you something. About what? Tifa always lets me taste her cooking, and look at me now! I'm roly-poly! Don't know whether I should be happy or sad, but it's good for- but it's good food and drinks that make this shop famous! And there's Jesse. Hey, Wedge! You're getting all excited! Stop making such a mess! Alright, as we try and go out the door, Barrett charges in. Daddy, welcome home! That's right, Angel, I'm home! You alright, Barrett? Great! Get in here, fools! We start the meeting! Yep, the, the hidden... The secret elevator on that pinball machine going down to Avalanche's secret base. So let's go to the counter and talk to Tifa. S have a seat. 
So, what can I get you? Hmm, I don't know. Something hard and bitter. I got just the thing. I'll make one for you. And then Tifa works her magic at the bar and creates her special tea, her house special, the Cosmo Canyon. Like in the remake. You know, I'm relieved that you made it back safely. What's with you all of a sudden? The job wasn't even tough. I guess not. You were a soldier. Make sure you get your pay from Barrett. Don't worry. Once I get that money, I'm out of here. Alright, so... Cloud, are you feeling alright? I'm fine. Why? No reason. You just look a little tired, I guess. Alright. So, in order to find Barrett, we must head down the ele down this hidden elevator by this pinball machine. Going down? punching bag. Yo, Cloud, there's something I want to ask you. Was there anyone from Soldier fighting us today? Hmm. No, I'm positive. <laughs> you sound pretty sure. If there was anyone from Soldier, you wouldn't be standing here now. Don't go thinking you're so bad, cause just because you was in Soldier. <laughs> Big's trying to restrain Barrett. Hmm. <laughs> Poor Biggs. Yeah, you're strong. Probably all the guys in Soldier are. But don't forget that your skinny ass is working for Avalanche now. Don't get no ideas about hanging on to Shinra. Staying with Shinra? You asked me a question and I answered it, that's all. I'm going upstairs. And I want my money. Shucks. <laughs> money. Wait, Cloud. Tifa, let him go. He looks like he still misses the Shinra. Shut up. I don't care about neither Shinra nor Soldier. But don't get me wrong. I don't care about Avalanche or the planet for that matter. Strain things up with everyone else for me, please. Alright, let's talk to Jesse. <sighs> Money? Oh my. Must have been for a lot of it. Sure, what the hell? It's a verbal agreement. Now let me figure this out. Oh, stop it, Cloud. Did you hear me? Cloud? You say you don't care, but you came to talk to me. Cloud, you just want friends. Isn't that right? I'm just blowing you off. Yeah, well, you look kind of lonely to me. If you ever got anything you want to get off your chest, you can always talk to me. And poor Biggs is still on the ground. Well, Cloud has had enough, so he's about to leave. Asking you, please join us. <coughs> Sorry, Tifa. The planet is dying. Slowly but surely, it's dying. Someone has to do something. So let Barrett and his buddies do something about it. It's got nothing to do with me. So, you're really leaving? You're just gonna walk right out, ignoring your childhood friend? What? How can you say that? You forgot the promise, too. Promise? So you did forget. Remember? Cloud, it was seven years ago. Seven years ago. 
Look, the well. Do you remember? Yeah, back then. I thought you would never come, and I was getting a little cold. <clears throat> a long time ago, Cloud, Cloud wanted to meet with Tifa at the well at night in Nibelheim. Sorry I'm late. You said you wanted me you, you said you want to talk to me about something? Come this spring? I'm leaving town for Midgar. All the boys are leaving town. But I'm not like them. I'm not just going to find a job. I want to be a soldier. I'm going to be the best there is, like Sephiroth. Sephiroth? The great Sephiroth? Isn't it hard to become a soldier? I probably won't be able to come back to this town for a while. Huh? If you make it, will you be in the newspapers? I'll try. Hey, let's make a promise. If you really get famous and a member in a bind, You'll come and save me, right? What? If I'm ever in trouble, my hero will come and rescue me. I want to experience that at least once. What? Come on, promise me. Alright, I promise. You remember now, don't you? Our promise? I'm not a hero, and I'm not famous, so I can't keep our promise. But you got your childhood dream, didn't you? You joined Soldier. So come on, you've got to keep your promise. <laughs> and Barrett climbs up the elevator of <laughs> the line. Uh, wait a sec, big time Soldier. A promise is a promise. Here. <laughs> And receive 1500 gil. This it? Don't make me laugh. What? Then you'll. You got the next mission lined up? I'll do it for 3000. What? It's okay, it's okay. Psst, we're really hurting for help, right? Uh, that money's for Marlin's school. 2000! Thanks, Cloud. And sleep the, sleep for the night. And ready and now well rested. Alright, now that we're now that we're rested up, we can now take the back up. Good morning, Cloud. Did you sleep well? Let's not lose any affinity points, but I'm just gonna say next to you. I uh, I don't know what you mean. I'm going this time. And Barrett? Our target's the Sector 5 reactor. Head for the station first. I'll fill you in on the train. Yo, Cloud! <coughs> Before the next mission, I got something I want to ask you. Uh I don't really know how to use materia. I'll give you that material we found. Just teach me how to use it. <clears throat> Alright, now if you want tutorials about how to use materia, we can just say, okay, I'll explain it. But since since I've already know how to play this game, I've played this game for quite a while, then I'm gonna go ahead and skip that. So I'm gonna select um you wouldn't understand. <clears throat> so this is what makes them guys and soldiers so great, huh? Alright, I'll ask JC again later. But you're in charge of the materia. And now we're introduced to materia system. 
So let's go ahead and equip our material once we're done with the dialogue. Cloud, I got a message from the weapon shop man upstairs. He has something he wants to give you. Don't forget. Marlene, you watch the store while we're gone. Alright, good luck! And you know what's weird? Leave, leave a little girl like Marlene? Watching the entire store? That doesn't seem right, in my opinion. So now we have the option to change up our materia. And Cloud has lightning and ice. Alright, and then Barrett only has one slot. So we only have two materia right now, but we will be acquiring more materia down the road. So now let's go visit the weapon shop. And, and it's this building over here. We can go inside. Hey, hey, wait a minute, you can't just walk out of here without buying something. I just have to for you if you know what I mean. So we have the weapon shop, so we can take a look at what he's got. He currently sells iron bangles, an assault gun, which we already have for Barrett, and I might as well equip that on him, I think, and then some grenades. I'm gonna go ahead and take a look at... let's... let's go... let's see... oops, not that one. Okay, so we have the Gatling gun. We did pick up the assault gun after defeating the Scorpion Sentinel boss in the last episode. So we're gonna go pick that, and he's got two slots. And they're linked. <clears throat> now the way materia, the way how the material slots are, you see how you see how this looks like an infinite symbol. These are these the, the two materials are linked together. <clears throat> so, so in the case they can be synergized with a set with a certain materia, which I'll explain down the road. Now let's head upstairs over to the second floor. Here we can talk to him. This is the beginner's hall. You say you're a beginner, but your eyes say you're not. Don't mess with me. I, I'm an, I used to be a soldier. I'll tell you how much I know, and, and for free, too. What do you want to know? So here you can learn different options about, you know, how to heal your allies, curative magic, weapons and armor, apply materia, effective ways to use materia, how to form your battle party, check your status, limit status. I don't have I, I wish I wish I could explain it to you all, but I but I don't have time. But I don't have much time. Alright, now that we're done, we can we can talk to him. And he's got a material there's a materia called all. Hey, you got you got one right off. That was materia. Next, take this treasure chest. And here we pick up a copy of Ether. Ether will restore our magic power by, by, I don't, I think it was a hundred, yeah, probably. Now listen, in these treasure chests are a lot of items. There are box types and bag types, so make sure you don't overlook any. Alright. <coughs> and this is the save point. Alright, now, now that we got everything we need, let me, let, let me go ahead and make, make use of the all materia. All right. All right. Gonna gonna send. Gonna put lightning on. And to make it easier on, on changing material, you can always go to go to arrange and select exchange, and then you can just put material. You can just equip material from there. Let's get back. Alright, now we're ready to go. And there goes everyone. And there's Johnny. I'm leaving, going far away, but when I come back, I'll be a better man than the, I'll be a better man. This is goodbye. Hey childhood friend, you better take good care of Tifa. <laughs> there goes Johnny. Alright. So let's go to the train station where everyone else waits. Alright. Yo! This 
say no private car, so split up! <coughs> Hoodlums again. Gosh, don't I just have all the luck? You say something? I said you say something! <laughs> Barrett. Now look at that! I got empty all- it got empty all of a sudden! What's going on? It's empty because of guys like you. <laughs> yeah, apes. You, you see the news, right? Avalanche says there'll be more bombies. Only devoted, only devoted employees like me would go to Midgar a day like today. You work for Shinra? I won't give in to violence. Barrett. Ugh. So, what are we going to do now? Why the hell are you so calm? You busted up my rhythm! Looks like they just finished collecting the cars. We're finally leaving. So, what's our next target? Ah, listen to Mr. Sirius about his work. Alright, I'll tell you. Jesse's probably already told you, but there's already a security checkpoint at the top plate. It's an ID scan system checking all the trades. Which Shinra's very proud of. We can't use our fake IDs anymore. Good morning and welcome to the Midgar Lines. Arrival time at Sector 4 Station is 11.45. That means we've got only three more minutes to the ID checkpoint. Alright, in three minutes, we're jumping off this train. Got it? Alright. Cloud, come over here. Let's look at the railway map monitor. Alright, so let's go check it out. It looks like you've seen this already. It's alright, come a little closer.
leader always stays to the end. Don't worry about me, just go. Don't go get this guy. This might be as hurt. So we can get him fishing. So far, everything's going as planned. Alright. Don't let your guard down until we get to the Sector 5 reactor. Biggs, Wedge, and Jesse got everything ready for us, so move it! Alright. So now... The reactor's just down this tunnel. Alright. So we just gotta go this way. And here we are. Those light beams are the Shinra security of sensors. We can't go any further. That's one damn tiny hole. You telling me to squeeze into that into that to get under the plate? No way! Yo, Cloud, what are you gonna do? We're going down. But damn, man, that thing gives me the chills. <clears throat> Alright, we're going down. All right, and over here we can pick up an ether. All right, here we have some new enemies. We have some new enemies here. This one is a choose tank, or and the one in the back is a fresh tank. And let's use bolt on all enemies. With one now let's see what Tifa can do in combat. to level up. We do get a potion. Alright, now we head down. So now we're right underneath the plate. Yep, and look look how high we up. We are high up in the sky, so you can barely see the bottom. <laughs> wow. <laughs> well, wow, we're right at the bottom. <laughs> right at the... It's a long way down. Yep. <laughs> Alright. Here we have another new enemy. Those are rocket launchers. So let's use lightning magic on them. Cloud, this way! The, re the reactor's up this ladder! <clears throat> Alright, so let's climb this ladder. And there's Jesse. I'm sorry. The ID scan's problem on the train was all my fault. I modified your ID card and that's what did it. I did my best, but I failed. Next time, I'll give you something better. I'll be back at the hideout in my research room working on it. Alright, and over here <clears throat> is a potion, and then we can, we can go down here, let's see what's down here. Alright, and there's Biggs, here we can find a tent, this will restore our stats, at, well, that we can use it at a checkpoint, like this one, so I'm going to go ahead and save here. Level. We're gonna pull out now. We'll meet up at the hideout. 
Cloud, we're counting on you to blow up the reactor. And there goes Biggs. Here's another new enemy. All right, these are protocols. and they are machines weak to lightning, so we have. Cast on, we cast bolts on the back row. All but one is out. Bear was there. I had Bear ready for this bolt attack. Special combatants or shock troopers. to open the chest. And Tifa gains a level. And here we find an ether. Alright, now this door we cannot open. And and of course the switches that will that we have to press simultaneously to open the door. 
Now, in the remake, I find that part in the remake to be the most hilarious part I've ever liked to experience. <laughs> we have to push the buttons all at once. Alright, shake it off. Three, two, one. Watch carefully. Move yours the same way as mine. Focus. Three, two, one. <laughs> hmm. Try. <clears throat> All right. Focus. Three, two, one. There we go. <laughs> we got it. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna go ahead and save here. Way. Shinra soldiers. What the hell's going on? It's a trap. Pre president Shinra. Why is the president here? Hmm. So you all must be. What was it? Avalanche! And don't you forget it! So you're President Shinra, huh? <clears throat> Long time no see, sir. Long time no see. Oh, you. You're the one who quit soldier and joined Avalanche. I knew you'd been exposed to Mako from the look in your eyes. Tell me, traitor. What was your name? Cloud. Forgive me for asking, but I can't be expected to remember everyone's name. Unless you become another Sephiroth. Ah, Sephiroth. He was brilliant. Perhaps too brilliant. Sephiroth? Don't give me- don't give a damn about none of that! This place is going up with a bang soon! Serves your right! <clears throat> it's such a waste of good fireworks, just to get rid of vermin like you. Vermin? That's all you could say? Vermin? Shinra- Shinra are the vermin you're- for killing the planet! Guess that make you King Vermin! So shut up, jackass! You are beginning to bore me. I'm a very busy man, so if you'll excuse me, I have a dinner I must attend. Dinner? Don't give me that! I ain't even started with you yet! But I've made arrangements for a playmate for you all. <laughs> Finger snap? What's that noise? What the hell is that? <clears throat> Air Buster, a technical soldier. Our weapon to build the department created him. I'm sure the data you'll extract from your dead bodies will be of great use to us in future experiments. Technical soldier. have a boss fight with the Air Buster. It's a machine, so it is weak to lightning. It does tend to change size, but it can attack from behind the rear. Rear gun. It can attack from both sides, from the front and from its rear. So it, and it will change, and it will change, and it will change it will face two different sides, left or right, and the big bummer would do a lot of damage. Wow, that did a lot of damage to Ferris, and that took the Ferris limit breaker. So let's use that. Oh, Cloud took a lot of damage, and that sets him. That, well, that was a good damage. And now here comes a counterattack. Ooh, Sarah needs to be. Alright, 
gonna have to use Cure on Barret. Uh oh, here comes another big bummer. That's not good. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that took out Barret. Just before I can heal him. I have to revive him with a Phoenix down. Oh, seriously. And I just revived him! Wow, come on! Focused on Big Bomber. And that limit break from Cloud finished it off. And that's it. You know what sucks is, if whenever you when you successfully defeat the enemy and one of your party members is is unconscious, they miss out on the XP. And we, and we do get a Titan Bango in the process. It's gonna blow! Let's go, Tifa! Barret, can't you do something? Not a damn thing. Cloud, please don't die. You can't die. There's still so much I want to tell you. I know, Tifa. You gonna be alright? You worry about yourselves. I'm alright, but take care of Tifa. Um, alright. I was wrong about you. Stop talking like this is the end. This isn't the end of the line for you or me. All right, hold on. Hey, buddy. You okay? Can you hear me? Yeah. Back then, I only got scraped knees. What do you mean by back then? What about now? Can you get up? Are we doing this? What do you mean by back then? What about now? Never mind. You should focus on yourself. I'll try. How about that? Take it slow. Little by little. Hello? Hello? I know. Hey, who are you? Hello? Hello? <sighs> you okay? This is the church in the Sector 5 slums. You just fell from above. You really gave me a scare. I came crashing down? The roof and the flower bed must have broken your fall. You're lucky. Flower bed? Is this yours? Uh, sorry. That's alright. The flowers here are quite resilient, because this is a sacred place. They say grass and flowers won't grow in Midgar, but for some reason, they have no trouble blooming here. I love it here. Alright. And who are you? So we meet again. Don't you remember me? Yeah, I remember. You were selling flowers. <laughs> I'm so happy. Thanks for buying my flowers. Say, do you have any materia? Yeah, some. Nowadays you can't find you can find materia anywhere. But mine is special. It's good for absolutely nothing. Good for nothing. You just don't know how to use it. No, I do. It just doesn't do anything. I feel safe just having it. It was my mother's. Say, 
I feel like talking. Do you feel up to it? After all, here we are meeting again. I don't mind. Wait here. I've got to check my flowers. It'll just be a minute. Alright, she's checking her flowers, and then let's go ahead and change up our, our equipment. So we can now put the Titan Bangle. It's got two slots now, and I'll have to change my material too. Alright. So we're gonna keep we're gonna keep the all lightning restore. And then we'll prob I'm probably gonna put the I'm probably gonna put the I the ice as well. Alright. Now let's go talk to let's go talk to her. Just a little longer. Oh? Now that you mention it. We don't know each other's names, do we? My name is Oh yeah, now in Final Fantasy VII Remake, she is called Aerith. But in the classic, we're going to go by we're going to go by Eris. We're going to go by Eris in the classic. I'm Eris, the flower girl. Nice to meet you. Cloud. Me? I do a little... Me? I do a little bit of everything. Oh. A jack of all trades. Yeah, I do whatever's needed. What's so funny? What are you laughing at? Sorry, I just... And then somebody approaches. Cloud, don't let it get to you. Don't mind me. Say, Cloud, have you been a have you ever been a bodyguard? You can do anything, right? Yeah, that's right. Then get me out of here. Take me home. Okay, but it'll cost you. Okay, then, let's see. Hmm. How about if I go out with you once? Ah. Uh. <clears throat> I don't know who you are, but... You don't know me. I know you. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I know you. That uniform. Hey sis, this this one's acting a little weird. Shut up, Shinra Spy. Reno, what I'm taking out? I haven't decided yet. Don't fight here, you'll ruin the flowers. The exit is back there. They were Mako eyes. Yeah, all right. Come on, get to work. <laughs> Reno. Oh. And don't step on the flowers. You just stepped on it yourself. They're ruined. They're going to catch holy hell. <laughs> now he says that. All right, so now... We have an enemy encounter already. So here we have a new enemy. These are hedgehog guys. Alright, Eris does not have any material, which I'll, which I'll be happy to work on her. Now, hedgehog pies are weak to frost, I believe. Frost, frost damage as well. Alright, let's use, let's use ice. Cloud gains a level. Alright, let's put some materia on Eris.
Arista only has one materia slide, so I just put it so I gave her the ice. Now we must find a way this way. Alright. Oops. Yeah, then we go up the then we go up the stairs. There they are! Over there! <clears throat> Cloud, that one! I know. Looks like they aren't going to let us go. What should we do? Well, we can't let them catch us, can we? There's only one thing left to do. This way. Alright. Alright, I'll hold them off. Right. Make sure they don't get through. She's getting away. Attack! Ah! Aerith! Think we killed them? They never should have fought us. Cloud, help! Alright. Damn. What's that? Aerith, hold on a minute. Alright. We can use these barrels. We can use these barrels. Let's, all right, now we gotta push the right barrels. I think it's this one that we have to that we have to push it over. Is it? Uh, let's see if this. Let's see if I remember. Is it this barrel? No. <laughs> Wrong barrel. Cloud, what are you doing? If you if you if you if you. Push the wrong barrel. You're, you, you have you have to fight one of the guards. Luckily, I put a material on Eris, so we will use fire on this, on this security soldier. Mm, so yeah, it was it was the correct barrel. The correct barrel I should have tossed was this one. <laughs> yep, silly me. Yeah, it's been a while. Ah! Okay. So the next barrel we want to push down... The next barrel we want to push down is this one. If I remember. There we go. Thanks, Cloud. Alright. And I have an encounter, too. More hedgehog pies. <laughs> okay, now Harris needs help again. This time, we'll push this barrel. should be able to catch up to us now. Alright, she's made it. This way. Another enemy encounter. looking for me again. You mean it's not the first time they've been after you? No. They're the Turks. Hmm? The Turks are a Shinra organization. They scout for possible candidates for soldier. This violently? I thought they were kidnapping someone. They're also involved in a lot of other dirty s stuff on the side. Spying, murder, you know. They look like it. But why are they after you? There must be a reason, right? No, not really. I think they believe I have what it takes to be a soldier. Maybe you do. You want to join? I don't know, but I don't want to be caught by those people. Then let's go. All 
All right. Let's move. Wait, wait, I said. <laughs> Slow down, don't leave me. Funny, I thought you were cut out to be a soldier. <laughs> so petty. Hey, Cloud, were you ever in soldier? I used to be. How'd you guess? Your eyes, they have a strange glow. That's the sight of those who have been infused with the Mako. I marked a soldier. But how did you know about that? Oh, nothing. Nothing? Right? Nothing. Come on, let's go, bodyguard. Alright, let's move. Alright, here we are under the rotten pizza. Whew, finally made it off. Now what? My house is over here. Hurry before they come. Alright, so off to Aris' house, Aris's house we go. And there's our save point, and I believe I am just about out of time. So, there we go. Alright, so I'm afraid I'm out of time, folks, so we will continue with the next episode of Final Fantasy VII Classic for Throwback Thursday next time. So thank you all so much for watching this video. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up. I would greatly appreciate it. It really does help the channel out. And if you enjoy my content and would love to support me, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and click that bell notification. Stay up to date on all my latest activities. I do have a Discord server that you are more than welcome to join. I post updates there as well, and you can also meet my other Starman fam. I do have a merch store over at the Galaxy Hound website. The link is also in the description box if you'd like to browse through some Starman apparel. I would love to see you guys flying my flag. Now if you would like to support me more personally, you can become a Star VIP just by clicking the join button next to the subscribe. All Star VIPs will get a special badge next to the screen name, and first info on upcoming new content coming to the channel and I have some special perks for for different levels of star VIP as, including early access to my latest videos up to one week in advance and members only content <laughs> interesting perks to have thank you all so much for all of the support you have given me and it really does mean a lot <laughs> and I will see you guys next time for some more Final Fantasy 7 classic on throwback Thursday <laughs> remember rise up be blessed and smile. See you guys next time.